I wrote I love you so much to a person that I loved on a public building and everybody responded to it. This is a little blip in my life and it's the thing that I've done that's sort of impacted the most people. so much. Well, it is next to a coffee shop, so maybe they're professing their love for coffee. Some guy was about to propose to his girlfriend and wrote that up there and then proposed right here in front of it. Or maybe like a valentine? No, not, not aliens. aliens. <laughs> I think, but I have really have no idea. I'd love to find out. My girlfriend and I were in New York and um, we were just walking around and we walked down an alley and there on the wall, um, was written in yellow letters, I love you so much. I think it was about two or three years after that trip. My girlfriend and I had gotten into a fight, but that might just be recollection of the years that followed. Maybe I was just being sweet and she was having a bad day. So I just walked down there and sprayed it and walked back up and drove away. Okay, kiss. <laughs> One, two. It's sort of the personal made universal, like I wrote it to somebody, but it sort of became just for everybody. I liked that about it, and that's sort of why I've never really talked that much about it, at least publicly, that I had made it. I kind of have always thought like it should, it should be for Austin, it's like sort of a love letter to the city. It is something that I feel joy when I drive by and there's people and they're so happy and they're smiling and they're laughing and they have their friends and they're taking goofy pictures, like I feel like it's the sort of finest thing that I've put out into the world in a way. That's so cool. I always knew it was a real sentiment, but I didn't know where it came from. It's kind of like a love letter on a wall. Maybe someone was doing it as a romantic gesture. Or even like a person just on the street wanting everybody to know when they walk by that you're always loved so much.